So I was just looking at the cover photo for this game on Steam, and I noticed that the old lady seems to be the caretaker or friend of that bird that was taking a nap on my head right before I had the hallucinogenic campfire nap trip, you know what I'm saying? Kind of wondering if there's something to that. Maybe she's more than just a crazy old lady that harasses me at the beginning of the game for no reason. So let's check out the Celestial Resort. Be proud of your death count. The more you die, the more you're learning. Keep going. To Madeline. From who? Okay, so this world that we're in now, the Celestial Resort here, this is the furthest that I've ever personally been. So, uh, I can say I recognize these guys. I've seen them before. They're the new, like, thing of this area. They, uh, I mean, obviously they're, they're deadly if you touch it, but, like, look at how they have eyes. Look at how that one, like, follows me. What are they? What exists up here, right, that created them? Are they magic? What are they in the lore? I don't know. And how the hell do I get up to that strawberry? Hmm. I wonder if I get any other abilities as I go through this game. And then maybe I can, like, backtrack and get some of these strawberries that I can't currently get. So this is the Celestial Resort. And that is bouncy. It appears to be a very old and dusty guest book. Many of the pages are damaged or missing. The comments, however, are glowing. <laughs> are they though? We'll never forget our time here. I've never felt more at peace. Thank you. They don't sound glowing to me. I don't know. There's a uh, sinister air about them. <laughs> Hi. Um, what are you? Welcome. May I help you? Are you a ghost? Good question. A ghost? Don't be silly. I'm the con concierge? Yeah, concierge of this fine establishment. Welcome to the world-renowned Celestial Resort Hotel. Positioned in an abandoned location, atop a mountain that barely anybody can climb. I'm definitely not a ghost, despite being a bloody skeleton at first before my flesh formed around me. Mr. Oshiro, at your service. Two guests in one day, business is finally picking up. Is that Theo? Has Theo been through here? How long will you be staying with us? Oh, I'm just passing through. I'm climbing the mountain. Do you have a back exit? A back exit? Just passing through? This will not do! How will I steal and eat her soul? You know I can still hear you, right? I like how bold Madeline is sometimes. In any case, our rear service door is reserved for hotel staff only. 
However, our top floor presidential suite features a world-class view of the peak. Yes, you'll be quite comfortable up there. Maybe I could get on the roof from there and climb back down? The presidential suite, marvelous idea, Shiro. What is your name for our records? Don't do it. Nope, don't, probably shouldn't have done that. I'm Madeline. But again, I'm really not interested in staying. Right this way, Miss Madeline. So is that, like, hot air that's just being vented because, you know, they had to warm the place? Or is that, like, you know, used up souls, maybe? Powder created from bones of visitors ground to dust? Who knows? You know, this hotel is not kept in very good repair. I'm not sure if you know this, Ashiro, but there are an awful lot of 100% deadly black and red goo monsters. And uh, also, if I couldn't, like, dash, I wouldn't even be able to get through here. So, not, not a great business model, in my mind, not as wonderful a hotel as advertised in my mind I'd like to actually make a formal complaint if I if I can is there like a maybe I can use Theo's uh, smartphone when I find him to like leave a bad review on what would it, it wouldn't be Yelp what, what would it be Yelp Yelp let's just change it slightly you know Okay, so I didn't actually look down there, but I guess there must be a door down there. Oh, hey, that was... I... wait, was there, there There was a wall there, right? I just found a secret? I didn't mean to go over here, I was just dashing to dash. Interesting. Okay. So that, I'm guessing that goes to the outside uh, little, like, patio that I was seeing as I was getting the key to come in here. How do I... Oh! There's a spring. Swear that spring wasn't there before. Am I just going nuts here? Cool, though. I had uh, mistakenly thought I wasn't going to be able to get in here. Whoops. What's that? Aha! That's what I thought. Damn it. So you don't get the strawberries immediately. You have to, like, basically get to a safe spot. And I'm not exactly sure how the game determines that, but it seems to do a pretty good job being accurate about it. Yeah! Yeah, that is what it is. Can I do anything else out here? I don't think so. Cool. Okay, so... Time to get that key. By comparison to that optional side room, that was, uh, very... Not challenging. Maybe that's appropriate, you know? Like, uh, the hotel really shouldn't be that hard to navigate to my room. Like, did you take my payment yet? Suspiciously, I was not requested to pay at all for the presidential suite on the top floor. Yeah, check this shit out, by the way. 
So I, I love this. I love the little like hairs. Um, it reminds me tremendously of a uh, mod for Super Mario World. A, there's a Cthulhu mod for Super Mario World that I uh, really like. Highly recommend it if you're into that sort of thing. But it uh, really makes me think of that. And I love how they turn into like, I love how it works. Like I love it visually, but I also really like mechanically how it works as like a, you can only touch it once thing. Really didn't come much into play there, but it does in the next couple rooms here. The elevator is just down the hall. The hotel is in pretty rough shape. Yeah. 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 Is it really open for business? I'm on to you. Not a ghost. Of course we're open! The Celestial Resort Hotel would never close during prime tourism season. Rough shape, what did she mean by that? What could she have possibly meant by that? Could it have been all the holes? Could it have been all of the black slime monsters? Could it have been that she died? Like, I don't know, how many times did I die before getting to this point? What could it be? What a peculiar guest, not wanting to die in the hotel they're visiting. Ugh. She doesn't even appear in an explosion of blood and bones. What a weirdo. So how do I get up to there? I don't think I can. I'll have to try that in another run, but I kind of suspect if I get through that room dashless, then that's how I get into there. Okay, so here is another dashless challenge because I have a strawberry with wings. Okay, so I think I can just barely hop over those. Yeah, whoops. Okay, so obviously can't go to the right there. Okay, so that's clearly something. How do I get into that? Let's see? Yeah, there we go. Hmm. Okay, so... Simple enough. You like the, yeah, that's what it is. I knew there was something to this. Okay, so in order to get that strawberry, I have to go back through this middle section here twice. So what I wanna do is leap off of this one and just boost over there and then Hmm. Maybe, yeah, like, I don't know, because then I lose my, my boost, though. But I don't need it on the second time through, so yeah, we'll, we'll save the boost now to get the strawberry. And then... Do that. There we go. That's what we want to do. Okay. 
So is this breakable? Yep. <gasps> Strawberry. Okay, let's let's add a little boost to that. Nope, nope. Actually, you know what? Can I just boost through the center of them? Let's just do that. Nope, can't do that. But, but, there we go. Just a little short hop. That's all it really takes. Can I destroy that? I cannot destroy that. Looks pretty destroyable. Don't know why I'd want to destroy it. It looks pretty destroyable. Okay, so, got a door. Gonna wanna hit all four of those, all right. Mm -hmm. There we go. There we go. And I'm gonna call that for episode two. So check back in later and we will continue to explore the Celestial Resort and definitely not a ghost to Shiro.